Hills in England, South Kirkby. Let's travel to South Kirkby, one of the towns in England. This time we're not going to rank it. We don't even want to discuss it as either a good or bad, beautiful or ugly, and richest or poorest town. Rather, we want to bring it into the limelight and prove that there's much to learn about a town regardless of its size. Where is Kirkby located? What are its prominent features? South Kirkby in perspective. South Kirkby is a small town in Wakefield in West Yorkshire. It is governed locally by the administration of South Kirkby and Moorthorpe Town Council. The town's motto is friendship, unity and progress. It's a small former mining town in the Wakefield Metropolitan District. Surrounded by other former mining towns such as Hemsworth, South Elmshall and Cudworth, it is close to the South Yorkshire border. This little town is served by two railway stations situated 1.6 kilometres apart. One is Moorthorpe Railway Station on the line between Leeds and Sheffield, with services being an hour on Monday to Saturday and two hourly service on Sunday. And the other is South Elmsall Railway Station, which is on the line between Doncaster and Leeds. A brief history of South Kirkby. The town appeared first in the 1086 Doomsday Book and still retains the site of the ancient Saxon settlement. It was mentioned in the book as Churchebi, which was one of the six manors held by Uchtred. But it may also be thought to be settled even before the arrival of the ancient Norse, believed to have arrived via Ireland around 900 AD. We learn that the name Kirkby means church and settlement. Through the centuries, the ownership of this land passed through the hands of many families. Later, the Molyneux family, who was Catholics, purchased all the manor lands in the 16th century and the semblance of that continuity existed. Despite the pressures of the English Reformation, this family retained their religious beliefs and never converted to the Church of England until after the marriage of Charles William Molyneux in 1768. For centuries there was a mill in the town and the flooding of land by the use of dams caused many legal disputes in the 14th century. That corn mill was in use until it was destroyed by fire in the early 20th century. Various leadership changes, reformation, revolution and industrialization have transformed the town throughout the centuries. Population and demography of South Kirkby The small town with a population of more than 10,000 occupies a total area of 2,450 square kilometers. This shows a density of about 3,711 residents per square kilometer. It has experienced an annual population growth of 0.69% since 2011, according to the ONS. In South Kirkby, there are slightly more females than males. The females, numbering 4,583, represent 50.4%, 50 while the 4,510 males in the town represent 49.6% of the population. The majority of the residents, 5,268, which is 57.9%, are between the ages of 18 to 64, while 24.1%, numbering 2,194, are minors under 18. Only 17.9% of the people in this town are 65 years and above, and they're 1,631. The town is made up of 98.9% white residents, numbering 8,439. Other ethnic groups in South Kirkby are 24 Asians, 19 Blacks, 4 Arabs, 45 mixed or multiple ethnicities and just two from others. About 72%, which is 5,789 residents of this town, are Christians, while 21 of them are Muslims. They also have five Hinduists among them, with one Jewish, two Buddhists and 24 professing other religions, with as many as 2,124 claiming that are non-religious. South Kirkby Culture The people of this little town have what is considered a rich culture as reflected in their love of music, arts and entertainment. An art exhibition at Kirkby Gallery to celebrate the works of four influential figures of the 1960s and 1970s was planned for the town. Besides, efforts of J&A Kirkby Entertainment Centre went a long way in improving leisure facilities in the area, including a bingo and social club which opened in November 1975. That was followed immediately by their two-screen cinema, which showed Paint Your Wagon as a first film. The 1976 production featured Lee Marvin and Clint Eastwood. A new lease of life was given to culture in this town following the redevelopment of the former Kirkby Suite building. The site that opened on March 2014 as the Kirkby Centre provides multiple key services under one roof, including the Kirkby Library, the Archive Resource for Knowlesley, ARK, Gallery, One Stop Shop, 
Adult Disability Day Service and the Knowsley Works team. The refurbished Kirkby Market reopened in 2014. In 2015, two of three proposed new public artworks were installed at Newtown Gardens. The first, named Tree of Life, was a six-metre cast replica of Knowsley Borough's oldest tree that has been around for allegedly 400 years. The second was the three-metre-high Edward's Elephant, a replica of the work of Edward Lear, who was reported to draw the animals in 1832. Crime Rate in South Kirkby To appreciate the rate of crime in this town, we would like to focus on the year 2021. The average crime rate for the year in the town was 119 crimes per 1,000 people. Considering the town, as it was normally done, with Moorthorpe, the crime rate was 5% higher than in the borough. That year, South Kirkby and Moorthorpe was the 51st most dangerous small town in the whole of England, Wales and Northern Ireland. It is also the 372nd most dangerous of all cities, towns and villages. For example, in September of that year, the town had the highest rate of shoplifting among small towns in West Yorkshire. And in August, the town recorded the highest rate of bicycle theft and was named the most dangerous small town in West Yorkshire for that crime. Then, in November, it topped the chart of the most dangerous small towns with the possession of arms in West Yorkshire. That month, it received three reports of possession of weapons. It has been observed that the most common crimes, however, in South Kirkby and Moorthorpe up till now are violence and sexual offences. Cost of living in South Kirkby Here we would just state the most reliable fact for your consideration. We derive this from the Economic Research Institute's Relocation ERI Assessor. Housing The cost of housing here is less expensive than the UK's average. Scoring the cost from 1 to 10 when 1 is the highest and 10 indicates the lowest, housing costs in South Kirkby scores 9 out of 10. The most recent overall average of all properties in South Kirkby is £149,743. Please note that the majority of sales in South Kirkby are usually semi-detached properties selling for an average price of £142. Food Surprisingly, the cost of food in South Kirkby is higher than the UK's average. On our assessor, it scores 4 out of 10. The ERI considers the cost of food, including meats, dairy products, bakery products, miscellaneous grocery products, produce, fast food and average casual restaurant. Transportation Also, the average transportation cost in South Kirkby is higher than the UK's average. On this, the town scores 4 out of 10. This includes the consideration of fuel cost, public transportation and consistent efficiency of public transportation vis-à-vis -vis a transportation price level index. The yearly total costs of maintaining and operating automobiles are also considered. Healthcare Healthcare in Kirkby is more expensive than the UK's average. It scores 4 out of 10. The considers the cost of a checkup, primary care physicians, visits to dentists and OTC pharmaceutical drugs. It also includes hospital costs. Beautiful places in South Kirkby This small town has a lot of nice places. One of them is Yorkshire Wildlife Park for those who are up for an animal adventure. This park is home to more than 475 amazing animals, including polar bears that you don't see elsewhere in England. Wildlife Park is another wonderful animal park that will take you and your kids all over the world as you see animals from everywhere, including the African lion, tiger, black rhino, camels and much more. Ponderosa Zoo is also there having attractions for everyone. There's a tropical butterfly house in this town, but butterflies will not run away from your kids. They have also Sherwood Forest Fun Park, theme parks and fun fairs, indoor and outdoor for children ages 4 to 12, Lightwater Valley for riding on flying swings and meeting modern day dinosaurs, Eagles Creek Farm. The Dome Doncaster has swimming pools and leisure centres where you can enjoy ice skating and roller skating. While we love this town for its outside environment and attraction, we don't like its high cost of living and high crime rates. What do you like or dislike about South Kirkby? We would appreciate your comment on this and the general content of this video. Thank you for watching this video. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment and turn on the notification bell. This is Learning Canteen.